It doesn't get any more tension-packed than this. The 2022 FIFA World Cup Final. Who is going to come out on top? Stay with us. We'll have all the action for you live on EA TV. Hello and welcome to a contest of colossal meaning. We find ourselves here just to the north of the Doha city centre, ahead of the 2022 World Cup final. My name is Derek Ray, and with me to provide expert analysis is Stuart Robson. And as you can imagine on this occasion, the atmosphere is building up nicely. It's Argentina against Qatar. Well, what an occasion for these two sets of players. A chance to be world champions. Let's hope the game matches the atmosphere. It should be an absolute cracker. I can't wait for this to start. The Argentina first team. Emilio Martinez is the goalkeeper. Lionel Messi starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks and leading the line, Lautaro Martinez. And here's the Qatar starting 11. Well, they're playing with a 5-2-3, as we can see it here. But I think at times we'll see one of the centre-backs stepping forward into midfield just to make sure they don't get outnumbered in that central area. And so the battle commences. Molina, Paredes, De Paul. How can he take them on and beat them? Shot attempted. My goodness, that save. Fully stretched he was. One for his own highlights reel. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. Nodding is over. Well, he was more determined than his marker, but he just couldn't get it on target, could he? So this is it for Argentina. World Cup winners in 1978 and 1986, runners-up in 1930, 1990, and eight years ago in 2014. Are they going to do it here in 2022? What a big night for them. Well, it's a massive night. And when you talk about World Cup finals, I always go back to 1978 as a great occasion. Ticker tape in Buenos Aires. The kickoff delayed because one of the Netherlands players had a cast on his arm. Mario Kempes, brilliant player. Ozzy Ardiles, that was Argentina at their best. Can they reproduce that sort of form here today? I think they can. Messi with the corner. Oh, a very fine header, but it wouldn't go in for him.
Abdulaziz Hatem. And they know they need to stop him. Now he must favour the cross. Di Maria. That's a routine take. Messi. Hassan al -Haidos. Is it going to end up being productive for them? Must score! And there it is! Living history! The opening goal of the 2022 World Cup Final! Incredible celebrations! Well, as you can see, he gets a touch on this, but it's not quite enough to stop the goal. It was a good effort, though. So, underway again here. One nil to score. Martinez now with Messi Al Rawi Al Haidos Ali Hatem Oh, showing good patience. They're trying to take their time, but not enough care on the ball. Molina. Now with Messi. Shielding the ball superbly. And Messi's incisive pass. And the keeper getting across to stop it. Can someone get on the end of this? Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Martinez. And with that, the attack fizzles out. A creative look about this. Messi, and using his body to good effect. This could square the game. Keeper getting the touch. Splendid defending. Fired over by Messi, and clearing it away. Martinez, well that's really strong play to keep hold of the ball. He must finish, and how well the keeper did. Well that's just exceptional, he reacted so quickly there. The corner courtesy of Lionel Messi. And the problem not completely solved. Di Maria likes to get on the ball. And he has teammates to pass it to. And blocked for now. Hatem. 
Karim Budiaf. Al Moez Ali. And with that, the attack fizzles out. A foul play, says the referee. And he gets away with a warning here. In my view, that's good refereeing. Strong, but not officious. Defence of Brazilians to shut them down. Paredes. And return to Messi. Oh, maybe the equaliser. Oh, a goal it is! The equaliser in this final. What next of the drama? Well, here we can see it again. Normally, I'm the first to point the finger at a goalkeeper, but I think it's a good initial save. I'm not sure he could have done much more. Just a bit unfortunate, really, that it dropped to an opponent. Away again here on the back of that leveler. Number 22, Lortaro Martinez. Hassan Alhaidos. Excellent refereeing, advantage in operation. Karim Budia. Almoez Ali. Budia. Nicely timed tackle. Rodrigo de Paul. The ball with Martinez. Now the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, underway once more, and it's going to be fascinating to see what developments occur in this second half. Oh, he looks threatening. Can he take this chance? Blocked by Otamendi. And a goalkeeper in great form. And he's just pulled off an absolutely stunning save there. That is brilliant. De Paul. Messi. And an astute piece of defending. Afif. Almoez Ali. Pedro Miguel. Chance to play it in. And they stopped them in their tracks. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? Martinez. Can he take advantage? Oh, it's in! They're in front here! Now can they stay in front? Well, let's see this again. What a pass this is from Messi, and what a clinical finish this is from Lataro. He hits it with such power. That's a good goal. Goal. Well, back underway as we reflect on the goal that's made it 2-1. Very good refereeing to let the play flow. Messi. Return to Martinez. And the keeper there to deal with it. 
And he decided to let the play flow, but now he's going to issue a yellow card. Yeah, I think that's good refereeing. He tried to play the advantage. And he's fired over the corner. Applying vigorous pressure. Messi. Alhaidos. And we're into the final half hour. Karim Budiaf. Just looking for the right moment for that final pass. Difficult to stop him. He'll be delighted to have won the ball, having made that difficult challenge. Paredes. Lo Celso. Marcos Acuna. The ball with Martinez. Di Maria. Crossing opportunity. A really top-notch piece of defending. Martinez. And a goal! Well, as you can see from the replay, it's the perfect through ball from Messi and he makes the finish look so easy. What a good goal that is. So the ball is moving again. We've been treated to four goals. 3-1 the score. Twenty minutes to go in this one. Martinez. And the attack carried an initial threat, but fizzled out. Karim Budia. Magnificent defending. Martinez Afif Almoez Ali determined defending Martinez Lo Celso. The ball with Martinez. Messi. What can they do from here? Chances on. In it goes to rubber stamp it once and for all. Just look at this again. The combination play in the top third of the field was so precise. And what an emphatic strike it is from Lionel Messi. Hit with his laces. It's a great goal. Well, if there were any lingering doubts about the outcome, surely they now have been removed. Hatem. Well, nicely cut out. Martinez. Messi. Marcos Acuna. And it's gone behind for the corner. Substitution then. Let's see how it affects the match.
elects to go short Otamendi well closed is it going to be the importance of that tackle cannot be overstated Hatem Boudiaf well he needed to read it to get there and did Martinez might be a chance here pivotal moment that's a foul and it will be a potentially dangerous free kick and the substitution will occur now Disappointingly, straight into the wall. And a short corner, let's see. Otamendi takes the shot and blocked for now. Short corner taken. Messi. Looking for the angle. Just the clearance that was called for. And there goes the final whistle. For the third time in history, Argentina have won the World Cup. And I have to say, Derek, they've been the best team in the tournament. There's no doubt about that.